If you're a subscriber to Spotify or you're considering on possibly being a new member, there's a new device approaching over the horizon. For those that are subscribed to Spotify, their music pl streaming platform, the thing is coming out. And what this little nifty device allows you to do is basically, if your vehicle is not equipped with an, a modern infotainment system, like a unit with Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, this may be something you might be looking forward to. It basically is a media player that allows you to attach on your vehicle. The example that they use is that they attach it on the air vent, which may be concerning depending on the area that you live in. As a fine example, here in the winter time in California, it could get really chilly. So as a result, you're gonna turn on your heater. Hopefully this doesn't cause any overheating issues because last time I mounted a device like my cell phone on the air vent using those vent attachments, my phone overheated. That's a little concerning right there. But Spotify has officially launched this new in-vehicle device and it has support for hands-free Spotify control by simply using your voice, just like a, a smart home device like the Google Home Mini, Alexa, and Siri. Hopefully I did not set off your devices. But it's good to know that it does look like it is equipped with physical buttons as you have a knob that you can rotate right there, as well as other buttons right there on the corner. It is indeed a touchscreen, according to the description they label and it's actually free you can put yourself on the waitlist actually the waitlist is currently live and you can sign up right now if you are a premium spotify member you'll actually get this for free of course in the us unfortunately now the dimensions of the display it's a four inch display it looks very colorful and bright i'm assuming there should be a night mode so when you're driving at night it doesn't just blind you and it's also noted to have four preset buttons so hopefully the operating system allows this device to work flawlessly. In other words, better have a good operating system. Now it is listed that it does pair to your smartphone. So I'm assuming as soon as this unit turns on, it will automatically connect via Bluetooth. But it is also noted that it could connect with an aux cable if needed to your vehicle stereo system or a USB cable. Now it doesn't look like it's gonna have a built-in speaker. And judging by the images that we are given right here from their media press, it looks like it is fairly loaded. I mean, there's not much into it, but it does look like they have additional ways you can mount this on your vehicle. As not only do you have the air vents mount right here, but it looks like you do get a sticky three-inch adhesive style, which means you can stick it on any flat surface that's compatible to stick this unit on your vehicle. And come to think about it, this is starting to remind me about what Sirius XM used to do. They used to sell these portable media kits or players for your boats or cars. For those users that are subscribed to satellite radio, but their vehicle head unit doesn't support it. This is what that's starting to remind me of. Now, Spotify does say that this thing is gonna be listed for $79.99, but it's giving it away for some of its premium users for free. There's no number that they gave us. They just said that a limited amount will be for free for current premium users. So if you are a premium subscriber and you live in the US, I would highly recommend putting your name on this list, especially if your vehicle isn't already equipped with a modern head unit that supports CarPlay or Android Auto. It's free to sign up and I'll make sure to have the link in the video description down below so you can quickly just put yourself on that wait list. So hopefully you get it. I already signed up. I'm curious and I'm excited to get my hands on this and review it in its own dedicated video. Other than that, hope you enjoyed this informative video. If you did, greatly appreciate if you guys actually leave this video a like. Those help me out a lot. As well as get subscribed as I basically cover a lot of tech videos very similar to this. And in the meantime, if you'd like to see more, check out this video over here as that is a video that YouTube is recommending specifically for you. And that video over here, that's just a random video that I selected. I hope you enjoy as well. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Take care and I'll catch y'all in the next one. See ya.